Hi, this video is here to help you with using column subtraction for five and six digit numbers without exchanging. The column method is a method of calculation where the numbers to be subtracted are set out vertically in columns. When using column subtraction, it's important to use our place value knowledge as the numbers must be correctly lined up. Let's take a look at an example of a column subtraction calculation. We're going to begin with a blank place value grid. What number is written on the place value grid? That's right, it says 567,893. I'm going to represent this number in the place value grid using place value counters. What value can you see in the thousands column? That's right, there are seven thousands in the thousands column. In this number, what has a greater value, six or seven? The value of six is greater because it is worth six ten thousands and the seven is worth seven thousands. Next, I'm going to subtract 23,451. Can you complete the subtraction by crossing out the correct amount of counters on the place value grid? Now we're going to check our calculation using column subtraction. Here I have an empty column subtraction template. I'm going to write my subtraction in the template, making sure that I write each number in the correct place value column. We're going to begin by subtracting the ones column. What are three ones subtract one one? Three ones subtract one one equals two ones. Next, we look at the tens column. What is nine tens subtract five tens? Nine tens subtract five tens equals four tens. I would like you to complete the rest of the calculation moving along each place value column. We have eight hundreds subtract four hundreds, which equals four hundreds. Seven thousands subtract three thousands equals four thousands. Six ten thousands subtract two ten thousands equals four ten thousands. Five hundred thousands subtract zero hundred thousands equals five hundred thousands. Our answer is five hundred and forty four thousand four hundred and forty two. Does your column subtraction answer match the place value counters left on the grid? Now I have a calculation eight hundred and thirty six thousand seven hundred and fifty four. Subtract 516,232. I'd like you to create 836,754 using place value counters on the place value grid and then subtract 516,232 by crossing out the correct counters. Next, write the column subtraction in this empty template. Does the answer to your column subtraction match the place value counters left on the place value grid? For your last challenge, I'd like you to carefully look at these column subtraction questions. Can you calculate which numbers belong in the blank boxes? Pause the video here to have a go. Here are the answers. Well done if you correctly managed to fill in all the gaps. I hope this helped you understand how to use column subtraction for five and six digit numbers without exchanging. If you're looking for more maths help, then we've got lots more of these videos on the Twinkle website, so go and check them out.